whenever anyone asks me this question, I always say the same thing, which is um, my job is to try to make sure as close as we possibly can, we're getting the right dose of radiation inside the patient in the right place. Um, and we know it's important to, to deliver a very accurate uh, doses of radiation, um, uh, more and more so as, as we go forward, as we're delivering higher and higher doses to patients that have had you know, some previous radiation as well, it becomes more and more critical that that dose is accurate, and that's, that's effectively my job. So, so medical physics really is physics applied to medicine, and the most important areas are radiation oncology, radiology, and uh, nuclear medicine, although we're also getting into other fields like surgery. Um, and pathology. So fields that involve imaging, uh, medical physicists have long uh, been uh, experts in imaging. In fact, you know, astronomers are physicists too and they're, and they're essentially imaging professionals as well. So, so we can contribute a lot from our education uh, into, the, into the practice of medicine. Radiation oncologists are our partners in uh, radiation oncology. I mean, they understand the biology of cancer, they understand uh, the complications that can have and how patients should then be treated to, uh, to help with the complications. So we're the technical experts, if you like, in radiation oncology. And the radiation oncologists are the biological experts and the clinical experts. And so combined then, we can form a team that can treat patients better and manage uh, the complications and hopefully cure the cancer.